Hello everyone, I'm recording this video on April 4th, 2022. Right now it's 1.30 p.m. New York time and temperature is 52 degrees Fahrenheit, that is 11 degrees Celsius. And I'm here at Roosevelt Island to give you guys an update of cherry blossom here at Roosevelt Island. And I do see that the cherry trees are start blooming it's not the peak bloom yet but it's already start blooming and it, it looks absolutely pretty so it's kind of update for you guys so you can plan ahead and hopefully after a week from now you can come and you can enjoy this lovely cherry bluesome here at roosevelt island because roosevelt island is one of my favorite place to see the cherry bluesome because it's very pretty and gorgeous with these cherry trees and this gorgeous view of Manhattan skyline across the river. So Roosevelt Island is always in my top one list to see the cherry bluesome in New York City. So in this video I will give you guys just an update about this island. I hope you will enjoy it. This is kind of an update video for those who are interested about Roosevelt Island and its cherry bluesom. So here we go. Start getting its bloom. And as I said, hopefully in a week it would be in peak bloom.
and the best way to come here you can take F train and get out at Roosevelt Island station the station is far up there but if you want to come from Manhattan F train or you can either take the Roosevelt Island tram that's another way you can come here I think tram is the more fun way to come to the Roosevelt Island because you will get some sort of unique experience I think these are the cherry trees that will be bloom almost in a week it's already start blooming but the peak bloom will be around like in a week from now and then the next part I mean later the April or the first week of May the quince and cherry tree will be bloom But when this will be peak bloom, I will again come back and I will show you guys the vibes. But it's just an update. NYC ferry this ferry will cost you two dollar and 75 cents the regular metro cart will not work for this ferry I had a whole video up on my channel about this ferry I took it from Long Island and head toward Pier 11 but they had different route available you can check out that video as well and these are the quince and cherry tree that would be bloom as I said maybe later this month or first week of May I mean Kwanzen is one of my uh, favorite cherry tree it's so so pretty And this is also one of the best place you can also get a pretty good sunset let's walk around this island and try to find some more bloom because I do already seen that some of the tree here are already in its uh, full bloom and this is the iconic Queensborough bridge
if you are planning to come to the Roosevelt Island in weekends then take your time because it might be too crowded but that's the fun part to enjoy this beautiful cherry blossom with people I'll definitely come back and give you guys another update forget to mention that the Roosevelt Island tram will also cost you two dollar and 75 cents that's the tram station and you can use your regular metro card in order to come here Cherry trees also blooming here. This is just lovely. this is an information booth right up here if you need any information you can get it from here as long as you come out from the tram this is the information booth and I'm now I'm heading toward the F train station so there are several way you can come here you can even drive here but the finding a parking might be a headache so it's better if you use public transportation system There's some gorgeous rhododendron. I can't wait them to bloom. I had few of them at my home. This is the tram basically definitely a fun way you can come to the island and you will definitely get a pretty gorgeous view of Manhattan skyline just in a cost of a metro card I mean a subway fare two dollar and seventy five cents This is the reason I always uh, make Roosevelt Island one of the best place to enjoy the Cherry Blue Jump Festival. I mean, not a festival, I mean, a vibes. This is the F train station right up here. I mean, one of the easiest way. If you don't want to come via tram, then subway would be perfect because as I mentioned, if you plan to come here in weekend, the tram might be very crowded, very crowded. And you had to wait. 
in that sense you can take this Roosevelt Island uh, subway station F train let's take a walk into this park right up there I see some trees are blooming and it seems like it's in a full bloom Wow love it and then we will check out the other parts and if you like what you seen then do not forget to hit that like button for me and you can consider subscribe to my channel for regular updates and video like that wow look at these flower palettes it's like a heaven imagine this place in a full bloom I love this view from here this two tree right here it's in full bloom goodness my good god insanely gorgeous that's all i could say right here now let's check out the other part
the good thing about this island they had this uh, marking you can easily find any location you want to find by seeing this direction and how many miles it away Again, this tree also not in full bloom yet. During night, just sit here and enjoy the Manhattan skyline with these gorgeous vibes. Is something unique you should definitely come here if you're ever planning to visit in New York City and especially if you are visiting New York City in spring then do not miss this place my friend the vibes is different here This East River will make you fall in love. And this city bike reminds me that yeah if you are tired of walking you can rent a city bike and you can just ride around the island and you can easily uh, see everything and at the end of my direction there is a lighthouse yeah so many things you can see here at that island Wow, this one is also in full bloom. Some of the trees are already in full bloom, but some of them still need a week or so. Wow, just love it.
Wow. I think I'll not make this video too long. I hope you guys enjoy this video. If so, then do not forget to hit that like button for me. And if you want to see more video like that, then do not forget to subscribe for regular updates and video like that. Feel free to follow me on Patreon in order to get the early access on my new videos and things like that. I will really appreciate it. Thank you so much once again everyone for joining. And I wish everyone a happy spring. And I'll see you guys somewhere else.